If you have somehow bricked your Steam Deck, upgraded the internal SSD, or want to remove other operating systems from the internal storage, then let me show you how you can clean install SteamOS by re-imaging it. If you don't have any serious issues like I stated, then you can just reset your Steam Deck to factory settings, which will fix any other issues. But note that resetting or re-imaging your Steam Deck will wipe all your data. So to reinstall the Steam OS, you need a computer running on Windows, Mac OS or Linux, a USB flash drive or an SD card with at least 8 GB of storage. Before we start, charge up your Steam Deck to avoid catastrophe. Now, on your computer's browser, search Steam Deck Recovery. Go to this official website and click here to download the image file. Accept the EULA, press download. While it's downloading, we'll go back to the main page and click on Rufus as we're running Windows. This will redirect us to the Rufus website. Under downloads, we'll select the exact version according to our operating system. This will take just a few seconds to download and requires no installation. Open it and now we will insert our flash drive or the memory card. If you only have one external storage connected, Rufus will select it automatically as you can see here. Be careful not to select a wrong drive because it will be formatted before installing the image. And our image has finished downloading in the background, so click select, locate the image file and click open. Expand advanced drive properties and enable list USB hard drives. This should change the partition scheme to MBR and target system to BIOS, which is what we need for this to work. Press start. This will take a while to finish, so don't take out the USB drive or try to cancel it. After it shows it's ready, we can exit out and remove our flash drive, then connect it to our Steam Deck using a Type-C dongle or a docking station, unless the drive itself has a Type-C interface. Now we'll shut down our Steam Deck. First, press and hold the volume down button and then press the power button. Keep holding the volume button until you see the boot menu. From the list, using the D-pad, select EFI USB drive and press A. It will start booting into the recovery mode immediately. And if it's the first time, this may take even half an hour. So be mentally prepared for that. If the process fails, don't panic and follow the process again by going to the boot menu. Now that we have entered the recovery mode, we'll double click the gear icon that says re-image Steam Deck and click proceed. Then we'll need to wait again for about 10 to 20 minutes depending on our luck. After the reimage is complete, press proceed again. And now you can take out the USB drive while your Steam Deck boots up looking as good as new. Just set it up and your Steam Deck will run as smooth as butter. And that's how you reimage your Steam Deck SteamOS. We go through a lot behind the scenes to get these videos to you, so a subscribe would be very much appreciated. Until next time, happy gaming.